So let us watch this dance of sieges continue and unravel. So he's just going to take the whole south because he has only one army and he's dancing around this army, never attacking for whatever reason. I think we'll just reinforce him. Just to give him a little bit more options what to do while he's walking around blindly. Because if they're a little bit stronger, they might choose different actions and just walk in circles. And it honestly looks like their play right now is to go retake this stuff now. Oh, goodness. Goodness gracious. You can't see it, but I'm looking at this with full and utter disgust. They will now combine, which at least reduces the amount of siege dancing. Put ourselves in the driver's seat. Oh, we're actually leading. Good stuff. Now there's a chance of this speeding up a little bit. Putting the siege leader in the siege lead. And we're no longer the siege leader. Oh look, it is going to go to war. Finally. Well, I mean, he's giving chase at least. He's probably going to cross a river into a jungle. Let us watch this amazing stratagem play out. Nope, he's just back to sieging. Ay ay ay. We a siege leader again? can tell over here. We're facing another dangerous faction. He's too good at what he does. There. Go and sabotage this and you just do your thing. We're no longer leading. Why are you... Oh, he's 22 in Marshall. That's why he's constantly taking over. But it doesn't matter in a siege. Only siege leader matters in a siege. Money. Should we risk it? It's a lot of money. Sure. Let's try. I mean, we still need our son to die. Who for some reason is well fed in prison. Oh, would you look at that. We have inherited this. Now ours again. And we need a new commander. To 
with that. And of course, we're crossing a river into a jungle. I mean, why wouldn't we? What else were we going to do? If we're being just honest to each other. What else could we have possibly done? And thus ends the war inconclusively, I believe. And to him we are now a... Not a traitor, just a title claimant. Are we? Ah, just for this. Why does he have so much? How much do you have? 800 something. Let's have an alliance if I can't attack you. Can't declare war on her anyway. Unless, of course, we fabricate a claim. Let's try. Uh, we can't try. Why are you... So completely alone there? Are, weren't you part of ours? No. Could subjugate him, which doesn't make a lot of sense. Could de jour claim this thing against 1200, which we can't beat right now. Okay, I will be your advisor, that's fine. You have absorbed my brother into your realm, it looks like. Which means we have beef. Oh no, I can only border dispute you. I can't afford that. But I can't attack him because... Damn it. We've truly lost this kid. But he's going to go into an alliance with us. Okay then. Good, good stuff. Could try and subjugate him. With enough piety, we could try and subjugate this guy. How would that work? We'd probably get the kingdom title, wouldn't we? Hmm. 500 piety, you say? it's time for us to join the peaceful ones gain a bit more piety there not going to donate to charity though we'll just enjoy a little bit of boost What do you want me to do? Theology focus. Fine. Just hold it for five years and then we switch back. If we even do that.
wondering if this would be better. I don't wish to be a commander now. I mean, 2,900 to get a kingdom title sounds pretty doable. How much money does he have? Not much more than we do. He's, of course, earning it quicker, but... Fine. What do you want to be? You want to be this, don't you? You want to kill the guy, our brother-in-law. No, I need him. For the war I have ahead. How old is he? 11. So he might just take a niece of ours. Very good, and so he does. A little bit older. Can we get something matrilineal out of him? I doubt it. Um, let's get her a matrilineal match. With... Someone. Aw, you want to marry a ruler? Such a misguided little thing you are. 15, 15, 19. He's attractive in all types of things. He's a good commander too. And it gives a non-aggression pack with someone. Must be good enough. And he goes in alliance. Just like that. Who are you? Oh, that's not even bad. Want an alliance? How much for an alliance? Too much. Who else do we have? More nieces. Let's give away some nieces there. Maybe someone who is not club-footed. Are you in a faction? No. Alright. So the succession is our son, our son, and then our brother. So he needs to die eventually. And we need to get our piety up. But also we need money. Fine, let's do it. Let's let's give away money. To get the plus piety here. How much do you maximum have? Okay, you're pretty close to your maximum. That's good. With all the allies we have, that should be doable. Are you trying to plot against? Doesn't show up as a known plot for some reason. He accepts our alliance, and we accept your request to join you, and we will indeed. Send some troops. Not all, mind you, but some. Can we rightfully imprison? Who are you even? You're nothing. You're nobody.
Our reinforcements might just arrive in time. Turn this battle into victory. Well, I mean, he took a shot and that's all you can reasonably do sometimes in this game. It was a fair enough fight. How did I pause and not unpause? Oh no. This broke down. Which means we can go to war over our digital claim. Which we should probably do. Once this war is done. Which it's probably soon. And we will just attach to this army until it's all done and done. Oh, we're leading, I think. So we can speed it up by putting ourselves in the driver's seat of this. Yes, let us become close friends with this man. And finally, we have fulfilled our ambition after that many years. We don't want to become king. I want to acquire a title. Let's become a paragon of enlightenment. Secluded meditation, which I don't think we can do because we are leading troops. Okay. Yeah, we can meditate and lead troops, apparently. Can we? Yep. And no more. We are also unmarried. Our wife, the ill-tempered, is dead. So let us get someone a little bit aged. But also good at things. Um, I mean, she's not bad. She's also homosexual. And she doesn't get a fertility bonus here. She's ugly. She gives us a non-aggression pack, though. Yeah, let's go with her. Just something small, but still. <clears throat> Who are we to scoff at these things? I don't want to release him. I want to have a chance for him to die of bad health in prison. Yeah, I don't know. It's everyone's concern that I'm marrying. Who are you even? Why do you have so many men? All right. more factions that are any sort of importance we're not going to give more They have already given enough donations. 
We're nearing the 500 that we need. And we can disconnect our troops, send them back home. Honestly, we can't stand them down because we are on home turf. Another grandchild. We're fighting this one. Prudent choice. I would have done the same. Hey, come on, finish it up. What are you waiting for? For the siege to finish? Yes, our daughter will be saved. Two thousand. How are we in a non-aggression pack with you? Oh no. Is this Duke? Ah, uh, drat. But that means he's our ally. Which means you're going to join us if we try something here. Where's the king of this there? How many troops you got? Can't subjugate him. Can't subjugate her. Can't get outside help for this. I want my kingdom title. You're not a king. Just another duke. Oh, well, that's really unfortunate. How many troops you got? 1,000. We got about the same, but we got va uh, allies you don't. But one of them is still in their conflict. Their silly little conflict. Can you just stop the war? You're done. You won. 100%. What do you want? We have become close friends with the vassal. Honestly, the theology focus is pretty good. Lots of positive things keep happening. Finally. Now we can get our de jour claim pressed and steamed and we will of course call in our allies okay our brother is like nope Ah, uh, he has hired troops. Which is bad because he can afford it and we can't. But I will be absolutely damned if I get taken out by hired troops again. But we absolutely can't afford any. But we're not getting even close to this in numbers if we pull everything we got together, including our allies. That's 700, 600. No. We'll do the same. We'll have to. Not really up to us. Deeply annoying. But what else is new? 
I'll go with these. They cost the same, but they are more. We just have to push for battle quicker than they do. Can we arrive there before they do? Yes, we can, apparently. But do we want to? It's planes. We wouldn't even get a defensive bonus. No, no, no. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, stay there. Stay there. Go into battle. Get the defensive bonus for us. Good stuff. It'll be fine. Come on, bring on more troops. More people are joining. How did that even happen? All right, and what we're going to do is we're going to select these, split off the mercenaries, which these are. Put these in half. Take the bigger one. Destroy it. Look at the cost we have, which is now way reduced. And we send everyone down here. Can we afford it? Come on, update. This is not the correct amount anymore. Update. Update, damn you. I order you to update. Okay. So with winning sieges, we should be able to afford it. Oh no. What a big tragedy. Our son is dead. Yes, but we have a oh god. Can we need to kill her? I forgot about the matrilineal marriage I put him in. Oh, he's actually willing to kill his own wife. Don't have the money to have him join us in that. Oh god, no. Why did I ever put you in a matrilineal marriage? All the trouble I put myself through. So for now we're going to continue the sieges because we need the money. From them. Not a lot, but it's enough to sustain a campaign. And why are we not leading? Who is this man? I don't even care. I want to lead. Stop putting me out of the lead. And then we'll just go and attack him. And it'll all be fine. Alright, let's put... This guy here, this guy there, don't have a flanker, so we just... Put ourselves in, because we're just that type of person, who just inserts himself into anything that happens.
Jungle, eh? Well, one flank's already defeated. And thus we win our little war here. Getting another piece of land for us and our heirs. And the duchy is finally where it should be. Could dissolve our alliance with him. How much does it cost us? Nothing, I don't think. What war is this? Subjugation. Oh no. He has our own idea. A shame. How do we take care of God? Yeah, we'll pay some money. We don't have to take care of anything else anymore. Comes to financials. Securing the succession is more important. Not this important though. No, it's not this important. And you are where? At court in Anchipura? At court at where? I uh hold on here. That is also the non-aggression pact I think we have. Go help kill that woman. How much money do you need? Don't even have enough to send it to you. Don't want to construct the temple, no thanks. So right now we would keep everything that we have because there's only one eligible heir. But the next in line, our grandson. We need to kill. Maybe it's easier to kill him. The sad state of affairs, but that's just how it is. Much easier to kill our grandson. And then we need to kill her somehow. Maybe if we went for Agnatic Cognatic, that would already be an improvement, potentially. Mm. Mm, who has a negative opinion of us? This man. Are we going to change that? No. Definitely not. Can we execute him? No. Because that would be tyrant business. Sadly, this guy is still very, very healthy. And we are not. I mean, if we can just kill our grandson and then succeed to him. 
And then divorce her. Can we even divorce in our religion? For money, yeah. What is your rebellion there? So his subjugation war is going well. And we have pneumonic. Uh, we'll go with what we know. We're not going to go for the brave treatment. Just get some successful treatment. That should be enough. Our faith will keep us strong and healthy. I'm not a fan of him winning this, but it's going to break apart anyway once he dies because he can't hold two titles at the same time. Oh, we feel better. How did he become the king of Mirzani? We'll keep that option open. He's going into another battle. Oh, he missed the window. All right, let's help him. <laughs> They're sending reinforcements. Don't you worry. Here we are. Got a whole 2% contribution. We're not even faking it anymore. Just stop your plot, boy. We are now known as the Lionheart, for whatever reason. Maybe because we honor all our alliances. Something like that. Going to take a short term benefit, like a little bit of health. Oh, we already no longer pneumonic. That's good. We're not going to go for war focus anymore at our age. To stay in theology into our 60s or something. What did you win? This guy is still there. I, what did the subjugation war do then? Nothing apparently. Commander, go away. Oh, you're quick. Good stuff.
Land down our troops, they don't need us anymore. Our wife has gout. But is being well treated. Alright, apparently there is a plan in motion. Take this de jour claim as well. But I don't want to. Alright, uh, so our grandson is dead. Next we need to kill her. And pronto. Ouch. 80 gold on that guy. No. Our son is not going to do it. 90 gold for 10% more. No. Intrigue won't help us. You try and seduce her. But we're really bad at all that, so unlikely to help. Let's switch to hunting focus. Now the succession doesn't look too bad anymore. I mean, if our son died as well... That would help. to break it like this either she dies or she doesn't let's pay we're not doing anything sensible with our money anyway right now expensive than a duchess well almost i don't i don't i don't accept this So we'd rather get some money here. Let's get some light infantry, some skirmishing troops done. Keep would also be good, giving just a flat percentage plus to everything you have. But that makes more sense once you have at least ones of each. Hike training ground. I like that. I like that you are somehow pike related I like that that's good at least she's homosexual so him be getting another child with her. Already a reduced risk.
And we could press this claim. We have enough troops. Even without our allies. 